In this video you will learn what is Copilot X and why it will change the development future. I already made a video regarding GitHub Copilot and if you don't know what is this, this is an AI assistant inside your editor and it just auto completes the code that you are writing in the best possible way. It really helps a lot to write code faster and eliminates the writing of boilerplate because you can simply autocomplete it from AI. But last week we got some news regarding Copilot X and this is the new idea how to improve Copilot which is not released yet and we don't have a strict date when it will be released. Let's have a look. Here is the official post regarding GitHub Copilot X and essentially here you can see that they want to merge GitHub Copilot with OpenAI GPT-4 and integrate it inside your editor even more, which essentially means previously inside Copilot we just had autocomplete for our own code, which actually means we are writing some code, Copilot will send this code to the GitHub, we are getting autocomplete from the AI and it gets back to our editor. Now they want to bring it on the next level, essentially they want to inject ChatGPT inside your editor and you are getting not only autocomplete from the copilot but also ChatGPT inside. Which actually means on the fly ChatGPT will understand what code you have. You can use it without Copilot X already now, you can simply copy paste your code from your editor inside ChatGPT but it is not that comfortable. As you can see here how it is planned, this is just a chat with your code and you can ask here some questions or AI for you can debug your code and find errors or just help you to refactor this code. So this is the next step how you can work with AI more efficiently, AI on the fly can analyze your code. And now we are talking just about a single file which is opened and for now we simply copied the code inside ChatGPT. But it might be that in the future we don't need to do that at all, it will analyze not only opened file but maybe the whole project and then it can find errors even in other files. So essentially what they are writing here is simply integration of ChatGPT inside your editor but this is just a first step, it will for sure become something bigger. And as OpenAI essentially belongs to the Microsoft and GitHub belongs to the Microsoft, it is obvious that all Microsoft products will have a top-notch AI support everywhere. For example here you can see their ideas how they want to integrate AI not just inside VS Code like an editor but also inside GitHub. For example when you are creating some pull requests you can get a nice autocomplete from your code maybe regarding what you did. It will save quite a lot of time if AI can understand your code and write in the best possible way what was changed. And additionally to that they want to bring AI inside your CLI, which actually means for now we simply need to write Linux commands like for example ffmpeg and then you need to provide a lot of different attributes and sometimes they are really difficult. But if you could type just a human readable text inside your CLI and get exactly what you need, this would be awesome. So instead of providing lots of complex attributes and arguments, we simply write what we need to. And actually if you are interested to know how to use Copilot right now inside your editor, make sure to check this video also.